I was in uh, a big chain drug store with a friend of mine, and uh, she she pointed out those little handheld shoulder massagers that they sell, you know, and she goes, she goes, those aren't shoulder massagers. She goes, those are vibrators. She said, no one uses those as shoulder massagers. They sell them like that maybe for a woman who's embarrassed to go to the sex store or so that the drug store can get away with selling vibrators, right? And that irritates me because they don't sell any equivalent products for men there. You know what I mean? Like, I can't walk in there and just be like, hey, what's that tube? And the guy's like, oh, this, this is to put lotion on a baby's arm. <laughs> <laughs> the little arms get dry, you just gotta rub it right in there. You can go as fast or slow as you Usually it's the dads that take care of the baby. Arm skin. Yeah, it is dishwasher safe. I don't know why everyone asks that. I'm in my I'm in my 30s. I, I've dated I've dated women that are uh, older than me and women that are younger than me, and I find a key difference is in their uh, uh, preference of sex toys. Uh, a woman in her 20s will inevitably have a pink or teal vibrator <laughs> that's about this big, and it's that sort of like hard but soft acrylic rubber with a little curve on the end, and it takes one battery and. <laughs> It uh, so, and it sounds like mm, and it fits nicely in the bedside drawer. And yeah, no, I know how accurate it is. Yeah, I know. Uh, and a woman in her forties has a piece has a piece of fucking industrial equipment <laughs> that fits under the bed, <laughs> plugs into the wall, and sounds like a ride-on lawnmower. <laughs> it's like, What is that a... <laughs> Is that a motorcycle gang upstairs? <laughs> now mom's just stressed again. That's... <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>